What could you possibly be thinking? You must realize by now that everything you do here is meaningless. The Jedi's mind can no longer resist me. <laughs> it crumbles by the second. When she is obliterated, only I will remain. Watch, fight, flee, bring as many friends as you like. Nothing can stop me now. You're wrong. I can stop you. Ugh. Foolish child! Look at them. Your Jedi and her weak-minded students, barely clinging to life, to sanity. They will fall, and once again, I will rise. No. Your power is your weakness. It blinds you. Jedi nonsense. Precisely. My students and I, who are we to resist your power? You knew you could dominate us all. That you could tear a path through our minds, absorbing our essence, strengthening yourself, crashing through all our defenses one by one. In time, your victory was inevitable. In time, you would claw your way here, into the very core of my being. Into the heart of my trap. <laughs> Trap. Look around you. Yes, look around me. Look at my students, each of them shaken to their core by the death and chaos that you helped create. Eager for help, guidance, strength. Had you focused on any one of them, you might have succeeded. But your ego wouldn't allow it. Why settle for one student when you could assault them all? And why limit yourself to the students when their master was close at hand? I never needed to beat you. I only had to let you think you were invincible. Until now. Until every person who knows your weakness firsthand could come to face you. Until the one person who proved you could be defeated came here to destroy you, once and for all. I am master to all Sith. Not one can challenge my power. You named me your wrath. Here, now, I can think of no better name. Enough! You will all learn the true depths of my power. <laughs> 